Yo guys, Ponchi here, and today, lo and behold, we have a new update for the Syntact, the Digitact, and the Digitone. Now, one of the most requested features and one of the most talked about features of this update is song mode. Now, today, I wanted to spend a little time to show you how to get into song mode as quickly as possible and start creating songs on your Syntact. Now, of course, this can be used on the Digitact and the Digitone as well. Let's go! Okay, so just as a refresher, the way to make a pattern chain on your Syntact is you hold pattern and then the first pattern that you want to start with, you press that. So I'm just going to go sequentially to make it easy. So you hold the first pattern that you want to use and then every pattern you press after that will add it onto the chain. So this is something we've had for a while now, but just as a refresher, you can see that it adds each pattern to the top there and that creates your chain. So now when you let go, we have a chain. It'll say playing chain, of course, once you press play. But to get to song mode, you hold the three dots over here and you'll notice song mode's off. Press yes to switch it on you have menu, loop, load, and edit. So if we go to yes to switch it on and then press right, keep in mind you're holding the button down this whole time over here, press right to edit song mode. So then now you have the song mode list. Of course it's empty right now. If you hit yes, you can create rows from a chain. So hit yes. So you have the two options from the current chain or create a new chain. So being as we've created a chain already, of course go ahead and hit yes. And that will immediately populate the rows with the chain that you just created. So when I press play, it shows you the position of the pattern right over here and then over here it'll show you which pattern is currently playing this position up here shows you the overall position of the actual song so if you want to know how many bars it is total bars that will tell you up here then also if you back out of song mode it has a handy position marker up here which will tell you which pattern you're on and the position of the actual pattern. So from here you have a few different options. Uh, you can label the different rows. They have these handy labels already populated for you or you can just use the pattern name. You can view which patterns you have here in each row. You can choose how many times you want each pattern to loop. This will tell you the master length that is set in the page menu. So after 128 steps is when the pattern will loop, but of course that is set by each pattern in the page menu. The metronome here will tell you the BPM for each one. And then the far right here will tell you which tracks are muted for each pattern. That's just a quick one for you guys today. Hope you're enjoying song mode. If you have any questions or comments, leave them down below. And I will see you guys in the next video.